The following contest is a six-man battle royal and is for the WWE United States Championship. Introducing the champion from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Weighing in at 305 pounds, he is the WWE United States Champion, the unpredictable Brian Scott. The United States title has been taken to an entirely new level of prominence and relevance with matchups like the one you're about to see. That's true, Cole, but if you ask the champ, it was all his doing. Many are predicting a title change here tonight, but this man is looking to prove otherwise. Oh, this is going to be and good. And introducing the challenger from Huntington Beach, California, weighing in at 282 pounds. So no A man who lives his life wanting to prove to the world that he's the baddest man around. And yeah, Joe always promises a beating of the highest order. You better be careful, Saxton. If you're not, Joe might also take your seat at the commentary table. That's what I call an upgrade. The black card is here. And introducing the challenger from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, weighing in at 201 pounds, Tommaso Ciampa! Tommaso Ciampa calls himself the Blackheart because he makes no distinction between friend and foe inside the ring. And Byron, that never bodes well for Ciampa's opponents. Now you look at Ciampa, you look at a guy who has threatened careers, destroyed limbs, ruined psyches, and that's for the people he actually likes. That's the genius of being able to take humanity out of the equation. Absolutely disgusting display by this man when he turned on his best friend, Johnny Gargano. And for what? To become champion? To yes. act like this? Yes. To disgust the WWE Universe to the point where they boo you out of a building? Hey, it, it just it, comes it, with the territory. It's clear, Michael. Tommaso Ciampa has no conscience. Introducing the challenger, representing Dirty Dogs from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 235 pounds, the glorious Robert Roode. 
Guys, this dude looks like a million bucks. That's an understatement, Cole. I think the robe alone is worth that much. Go! Get up! Robert Roode with two decades of experience. He's been a champion everywhere. A champion who lives the best life, jet-setting all over the globe. The sky is the limit for Robert Roode in a WWE ring. So proud of all of his accomplishments. Why wouldn't he be? Byron, if you ever accomplished anything in your life, you'd understand. I accomplished a thing or two. I love this. An entrance befitting of a true superhero. And the best part about it, Saxton, is this isn't a movie. This isn't a comic book. This is real life. Not CGI, not special effects. Ricochet is the real deal. And introducing the challenger from Paducah, Kentucky. Weighing in at 190 pounds. Ricochet! Ricochet is set for action. Just amazing to watch if the match isn't even started yet. Well, Ricochet better be careful not to tire himself out before the bell rings. You can start the countdown now. We are moments away from another imminent highlight when Ricochet is in action. One of the most incredible athletes in WWE today. Half man, half amazing, but all business. He's the founder of the Hurt Business. And introducing the challenger, representing the Hurt Business from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 259 pounds. MVP! Who can forget that MVP once held the United States Championship? for 343 days, which at the time was a record. After a tough upbringing, nine years spent locked up, MVP is living proof. You don't let past failures define you because now all he does is win. Mandy Rose wasn't lying when she said this would be a unique title defense because the United States champion is about to face off against five former United States champions in a six-man battle royal. The Golden Goddess never lies, Cole. Champion of champions has a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Every one of these superstars wants to walk out of this ring tonight as the best of the best. Let's find out who can actually pull it off. Big overhand. Sweet. The challenger is looking shaken. Oh, what a spear! Low kick. Low kick. Point to the hamstring. Oh, MVP my. has been eliminated. Tagged with a punch. Slam.
The United States champion persevered through an extremely difficult challenge tonight to walk away victorious. Yeah, after surviving that match, you have to wonder if there's any obstacle he can't overcome. It's Dolph Ziggler! Zigzag! What the heck? What was that all about? Just when it looked like the United States champion had no more obstacles to clear, now he has the show-off standing in his way. Dolph Ziggler is a former United States champion himself. This is only speculation, but maybe he was upset he was left out of the match tonight. That could be, but nonetheless, the champion now appears to have a significant problem on his hands. Let's hear what our United States champion has to say before his title defense. You all saw what happened last week when Dolph Ziggler attacked me after the U.S. Champions Battle Royal. I guess he was a little upset he wasn't included and feeling overlooked in general. So, I promised Dolph that I'd come out here tonight and recognize some of the amazing moments from his career. So, let's start at the beginning where Dolph proved he was special from day one, debuting in WWE as a preppy-looking golf caddy. How could anyone ever overlook that? Not wanting to become too big of a star too fast, Dolph then decided to become a male cheerleader. He truly was a show-off of both versatility and spirit. <laughs> After those two stints were so overwhelmingly successful, Dolph again didn't want to outshine his fellow superstars, so he decided to go back to developmental to come up with another amazing persona and give back to future superstars. After this hiatus, Dolph would return and continue to annoy, I mean entertain, the WWE universe for the past decade and a half, even trying his hand at stand-up comedy in front of as many as 20 to 30 people. Speaking of jokes, I think that's about enough of that. Now I'm gonna tell you the truth about Dolph Ziggler. He's not given the credit he thinks he deserves because he has no identity. A caddy, a cheerleader, a stand-up comedian. How can he be recognized if he can't even recognize himself? But here's the thing, I know who I am. And that's the United States champion who will kick anyone's ass who gets in my way. So, Dolph, after I'm through with my match tonight, you won't be overlooked. You'll just be next. Strong words from the United States champion. He'll defend his title coming up next. This is all for the right to call yourself the United States Champion. To put yourself in the echelon of John Cena, Ricky Steamboat, Steve Austin, some of the greats of all time. Over 40 plus years of history for the United States Championship and a new chapter is written tonight. And returning to the ring. Jeez. Spinning kick in the gut, great reversal. First with a reverse STO. Planted with a choke slam. Discus Lariat. That was nasty. No. 
drives a foot. Here we go. You run down Dolph Ziggler like the U.S. champion did, and you're going to pay. Where is he, though? Or you pay in the form of mind games. Either way, it's effective. to the body, treating their opponent like a heavy bag. Boom! Big uppercut. Yokes up their opponent. Sidewalk slam delivered. The challenger eating up some damage. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Boom! Exploded. Ricochet down, much to the crowd's dismay. Ricochet's night is not going according to plan. But Ricochet has to push now while there's an opening. Spear! Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Jackknife powerbomb. What now? Ah, uh, stop right to the gut. Athleticism from Ricochet. Ricochet finding a way to slow his opponent's assault down. Yeah, but he needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. And he's keeping the pressure on. Yeah, it seems like he can't be stopped. A bad place to be for the challenger. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. Oh, man. Vulgar display of power here. And he sends him into the corner. What a counter. But Ricochet has to push now while there's an opening. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Oh, look at this. Close line in the corner. There's more. Ooh. Here comes the side slam. Sidewalk slam! Almost drove him through the ring. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Whatever's planned here can't be good. Raining down those right hands, trying to escape. Uh, shots to the body. Treating their opponent like a heavy bag. Boom! Big uppercut. This offense causing Ricochet to wind down. And Ricochet needs to create separation. Got to find a way to get out of this. Final time, the last ride! He's positioning himself, closing in. Here it comes. Looking for a choke slam. Another one bites the dust to the champ. Buster. Such a potent. And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with his home. Oh, it's locked in. Tap out. Do it now. Live to fight another day. Forces his opponent to tap out. Got it. And the champ adds to their legacy. Here is your winner. And still, the WWE United States Champion. The unpredictable. Brian Scott. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamrolling.
following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE United States Championship. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. The champ has never looked more focused, laser focused on the task at hand. Ah, the dirtiest of dogs! The show off! And one of the toughest veterans on the entire WWE roster. Not about showing off anymore for Dolph Ziggler because he believes he's accomplished everything he needs to in WWE, and he's right. You know, Dolph Ziggler has twice been the sole survivor at Survivor Series. Well, sometimes you forget just how much Dolph Ziggler has really accomplished in WWE. But this is a superstar who has stood the test of time. Uh, he's truly a top dog, no doubt about that. Introducing the challenger from Hollywood, Florida, weighing in at 218 pounds, Dolph Ziggler. And introducing the champion from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 305 pounds. He is the WWE United States Champion. The unpredictable Brian Scott. One of the most prestigious titles in all of sports entertainment here for the taking, the United States Championship. The United States Champion defends his title against a superstar on a mission to win another U.S. Championship, Dolph Ziggler. It sure feels like Dolph's fighting two superstars tonight. The defending United States champion and the chip on his own shoulder. And I'm not sure he can handle both. Strong words, Saxton. Underestimate the show off at your own peril. And I'd give the same advice to our United States champion. Uh-oh. It's gonna... We're gonna see it! Stop! Ziggler intercepts. Sent into the corner. Oh, vicious body shot. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Discus Larian. Ziggler now lacking any signs of resistance. Any attempts of offense from Dolph is just being sapped. The challenger's looking shaken. The 
throat. Oh, man, check out this power. Gorilla press slam. Driven down with an elevated flatliner. He's been placed in the corner now. This oh, look at this. Oh. In full control. Sidewalk slam. Almost drove him through the ring. He's been quickly taking control here. Keeping the pressure on. What now? Oh, not to the belly. Springboard. And that failed to hit the mark. Oh, yeah. Okay, he is not going to let him make a mockery of things. Ooh. And set him up. Oh, oh, the face. Face. That's going to hurt. Hey, stop! Remarkable power being shown here. And Ziggler is falling behind here. Dolph's having trouble assessing the situation. Placed in the corner. Strong suplex. Hits to the core like that will render you useless. A strong head scissors application. And now the elbow's vicious. Being carried around with ease. Oklahoma slam. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Final time, the last ride. Uh -oh. up. This is not going to end well. Oh, a joke slam. Thunderous. The champ has this one in hand now. And I think we just might see. Oh, driver. Spiked him. Can it be? Will the range get... Great trouble here. Can he get it fully locked in? No. And he's just in reach of the ropes and gets it to force the break. The ropes become a competitor's best friend in desperate moments like that one. Ooh. Ziggler now lacking any signs of resistance. Dolph's got to find a way to defend himself. Oh, and soon we could be seeing a submission here. Into an armbar. Submission move locked in. Dolph Ziggler. Tap out. And the champ retains. Here is your winner. And still... The WWE United States Champion, the unpredictable Brian Scott. And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation.
The following contest is a two out of three falls match and is for the WWE United States Championship. It's a big fight feel here tonight as the title is on the line. And title matches like this have a way of getting your blood flowing unlike any other match. The champ certainly has his hands full here tonight, but he looks more than ready. Ah, the dirtiest of dogs! The show-off! And one of the toughest veterans on the entire WWE roster. showing off anymore for Dolph Ziggler because he believes he's accomplished everything he needs to in WWE and he's right. One of WWE's most accomplished superstars, a multi-time world champion, multi-time intercontinental champion, multi-time tag team champion. Is there anything Dolph Ziggler can't do? Dolph Ziggler has done it all. He has truly proven himself to be one of the best in all of WWE. Introducing the challenger from Hollywood, Florida, weighing in at 218 pounds, Dolph Ziggler. And introducing the champion from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 305 pounds. He is the WWE United States Champion. The unpredictable Brian Scott. Winning the United States Championship etches your name with legendary company. The United States Championship is on the line tonight in a matchup between the defending U.S. champion and a past champion looking to regain his former glory. Leave it to Dolph Ziggler to talk his way into a rematch he doesn't even deserve. Dolph can talk, I'll give you that, but he can fight like hell, too. The United States Champion better be ready for a war tonight. Stunning display of power! with a reverse STO. Oh, that might have just broken something. Seated drop kick. And set him up. Oh, the to the face. That's gonna hurt. And Ziggler is falling behind here. Any attempts of offense from Dolph is just being sapped. Dolph gets out of there. Oh, what a clothesline. Keeping in close quarters, and look at these lefts. Now, this is just a ruthless attack. Oh, such aggression. 
jarring European uppercut. Spine buster. Nighty night. The challenger's looking shaken. Oh, the elbow drop. Knee crusher. And again, and again. Ruthless. Uh-oh, no, don't do this, don't do this. A foot right to the belly. And he's showcasing some dominance here. Yeah, he is sparing no energy right now. Good grief, that was a big choke slam. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Really just laying it in. Oh, kick connects. Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Nice counter by Ziggler. Ziggler reversing the momentum on him. Yeah, Ziggler's survival instincts are taking over. Big boot. Ziggler just unable to stop this attack. Any attempts of offense from Dolph is just being sapped. And no matter what happens in this match, you cannot discount the incredible offensive repertoire we are seeing from this superstar. Tough position to be caught in here. Final time, the last ride! Cover! Two count, three, no! Title match continues. How in the world did he do that? Hold on a second, could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. Uh-oh, in the clutches. I think he's got it locked in good. I just don't know how to counter this thing. I don't want to... And he chooses to let go of the hold. But just the amount of time he was in that submission could be very significant. Dolph's in an unlucky spot. Oh, the driver spiked him. Now that is why they're the champ. Cover! Two! Ziggler is falling behind here. Dolph's got to find a way to defend himself. Choke slam. Here it comes. Looking for the choke slam. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? Into it off. And the ropes forced to break. He did not want to be caught up in that submission any longer. The power on display right now is ridiculous. Ah, uh, stop right there in gut. Treating the torso to yet another attack. Getting back into the ring. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Straining those muscles. And after all that punishment, he had no choice but to tap out. And the champ stands tall once again. Here is your winner. And still, the WWE United States Champion, the unpredictable Brian Scott. Wrestle perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamrolling.